Hey guys, welcome back to Clean Green Being. I'm Erin, and today I'm super excited to share with you my favorite company for pacifiers and pacifier clips called Ryan and Rose. But before I get started, don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any of our videos that we upload every Sunday and Wednesday. Ryan and Rose is a Memphis based company that was started by a mom who was in search of a pacifier clip that was both made out of high quality materials as well as safe and when she struggled to find that she decided to take matters into her own hands and make her own and i share that story with you because that's initially what drew me into the company i love supporting small businesses but i also just really love the story of this mom just having it in her heart to design something not only for her baby but for all the babies out there um, that is safe and is made out of high quality material. All of their products are tested for lead and other hazardous chemicals as well as safety tested and all of their products exceed US safety standards and regulations. The Ryan and Rose pacifier clips are called cutie clips and they range in materials from silicone beads to wooden beads to leather to macrame. There's a whole bunch of fun designs um, on their site. You'll have to just check them out, but I have a couple of um, options here to show you. The Cutie Clips were redesigned to be shorter, safer, and made out of more high quality material than what's out there on the market. And one of the reasons that they were designed to be shorter is so that when your baby's crawling along the floor and the pacifier is hanging from their outfit, it's less likely to drag across the floor and get dirt on it when your baby's gonna stick it right back in their mouth. So I have a couple options to show you here. So the first style I have is the Quinn, and this is the mini size, which ranges from six and a half to six and three quarter inches. It's the shortest one that they offer. And this Quinn, is in the color unicorn which is just this really really adorable pastel rainbow color the beads are they're made out of medical grade silicone um, we have the string on the end which you can string through the pacifier or sippy cup or snack cup or whatever you're using to um, attach and then we have the stainless steel clip on this end so all you have to do is pop up the top circle and that opens the teeth and you can insert the shirt or whatever you're clipping this onto, shut the top, and that's it. Next, I have the Mila, which is a midi size, and that ranges from seven to seven and a half inches. And this is just a really, really gorgeous macrame. This is the only macrame that I have, but they do offer several options, so I think I will be buying more. And what I love about this is that it's just so soft, especially since I have a two month old and it's just very flexible and it just lays so nicely on her um, when she's sleeping and I don't worry about it, um, you know, causing her any discomfort or anything because it's just so soft against her skin. And finally, I have the Ruth clip, which is the maxi size. That's the largest size that they offer and that's seven and three quarter inches long. And the Ruth is made out of these wooden beads with a little pop of color with these colored silicone beads. This one's super cute. It's just a little long, I think, for my two month old, so I haven't used it yet, but look at how cute it looks with my purple pacifier. The Ryan and Rose pacifiers are called Cutie Pats, and they can be used as a pacifier and as a teether. And I have a couple of different colors here. I have white, clear, and this pretty little blush baby girl pink. I love this one. Um, and these are all what they refer to as core colors. They keep these stocked. They also have some gray, blue, some other core colors on their site. And this is one of the limited edition colors. This is the purple. They release limited edition colors every so often. Um, sometimes they bring them back, but you really have to follow them and, and make sure you jump in and get their limited edition colors before they sell out. Um, but these are the four that I have. And the Cutie Pats come in two different sizes, a stage one and a stage two. And the stage one is meant for babies without teeth and the stage two is meant for babies with teeth. And the difference really is in the nipple. The stage one is just a little softer and the stage two is a little firmer um, for babies with teeth. 
if babies are using this as a teether, they recommend that the nipple be pushed in like this so that it's not um, sticking out to be chewed on because that piece isn't meant to be chewed on. They can use the shield or they can use the handle um, to use for a teether. The cutie pads are made out of medical grade silicone. So not only do I know that it's safe, I also love the feel of them. They're so soft and flexible. The silicone is just velvety soft. I don't know how else to describe it. It's just so soft. It's all one piece. So you don't have to worry about anything falling off. And you also don't have to worry about any hard plastic against baby skin. These are just so soft. I love them. So, a couple of different features. The shield is a little bigger and rounder than what you might be used to seeing out there, but it's meant to mimic the comfort of mother's breast. And the air holes are also a little bit larger as well. And that's to ensure that baby is getting plenty of good airflow behind the pacifier as they're using it. The nipple is a little firmer in the tip, a little softer in the middle. And honestly, I think this is the reason that these pacifiers are my daughter's favorite because they're very soft, but the tip um, is firm. And I think that that creates the support that's needed so that the nipple doesn't collapse when she's sucking on it. Um, it's soft yet supportive at the same time. The handle can be used as a teether as well as the shield. They just recommend that when baby's using this as a teether that you pop the nipple in because the nipple isn't made to be um, chewed on or used as a teether. So just pop that in and you have yourself a little teether. One other thing that I found with the cutie pads is that they fit perfectly on my thumbs. <laughs> so if I'm using my hands to pick up baby and move her somewhere or I have my hands full of something else, I can just easily slip these over my thumbs and do what I need to and have the pacifier handy. The last Rhino Rose product I have is the Cutie Tensile, and that's the combination fork spoon utensil that's made out of the same medical grade silicone as the Cutie Pads. And the spoon is um, pretty much your typical spoon, but the fork end is what is really unique. And I would encourage you to go on the Rhino Rose Instagram, they have videos of um, babies using these and you can really see how well they pick up food. They're easier to use than a regular baby fork. They um, promote development of fine motor skills and um, they also really help with baby led weaning if that's something that you're um, getting into. So I have this in gray. They come in other colors too and even though I only have a two month old I plan on buying it in other colors because once I got it in the mail I just saw how high quality is and how nice it is and I've been convinced by their videos online on how um, easy they are for babies to use so I plan on buying more. So that's it for my Ryan and Rose review. In summary, I highly, highly recommend this company. I love their products. They're super cute but they're also safe and designed with baby's needs in mind. I've seen many other styles in person. They've just come in my door and out my door as presents, so I don't have all of them to show you, but I can tell you that everything that I've ever bought from them is just super cute, same high quality material. And like I said, these cutie pads are my daughter's favorite pacifiers. We don't use anything else, so I don't know um, what speaks greater volumes than the opinion of a two month old. <laughs> Um, but RyanandRose.com, be sure to check them out. Do I hold these? Okay. This is take 57. It's like 2 in the morning. If Adelie wakes up, I'm gonna cry. <sighs> I'm just rubbing fingerprints off of the clips. Okay. I just want to wash my makeup up and go to bed.